Okay, so let's talk reality TV. So the 90 Days Fiancé fans calls out Debbie's boyfriend, Tony's problematic tattoo. So join me, let us dissect this. If you're a 90 Days Fiancé fan, then you know about this. But before that, please do subscribe. Turn on notification bell so you are going to be dissecting and analyzing with me. Welcome back, Trending Gist Lovers. I remain your girl, Octavia Cora. So today we're talking about a reality TV show called The 90 Days Fiancé. Okay, so one of the stars, her name is Debbie Johnson. So she's the one we're going to be dissecting and analyzing her relationship today. So Debbie Johnson from 90 Days Fiancé is madly in love with a man named Tony who fans are calling out for uh, supposedly having a tattoo of Eustace, I hope I didn't murder this name, <laughs> uh, Eustace, a Croatian fascist and ultra-nationalist organization on his back. In the 90 day, the single life season 3, Debbie found love in her Canadian Santa Claus. Yeah, the guy does look like a Santa, right? <laughs> With his white beards and all of that. Okay, it's Canadian Santa Claus. Okay, so Tony, 13 years after Colt Johnson's father and her ex-husband died, the 70-year-old had been married for 27 years to Harley Johnson. And after Colt found his life partner in Vanessa Guerrera, his mom also wanted a love life of her own. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> Not only the son is going to be having fun, mom wants in too, okay? Son is getting out of the house. She's going to be lonely. So yes, anyways, let's finish reading this. Okay, so she wanted a love of her own. Debbie met Tony online via a Canadian friend and met him in person in Las Vegas where they had quite the romantic weekend together. Mmm. Mama the mama, she's not slowing down, okay? Age is just a number, or should I say age is nothing but a number? Okay, so if you're a 90 Days fan, please jump on the comment section. Come on, come on, come on. I want us to have a whole conversation about Debbie and her Santa, or should I say Tony, aka Santa-looking boyfriend. And tell me, what do you think about the tattoo? On a more serious note, I don't know so much about his tattoo or this Croatian uh, fascist group and whatnot. If you happen to be a Croatian and you come across this video, please enlighten us. Give us more updates about that so we get to know, you know, we never stop learning. It's good to learn and know something about other people, their culture and whatnot. So let me know what you think. Uh, was that offensive to you and whatnot? But yes, we'll keep watching the 90 Days Fiancé so we know if he's ever going to address this well i'm going to also keep my eyes on ground and if you come across this video and you see anything please let me know so i can update you all if debbie and her boyfriend tony is going to address this tattoo that fans are upset about or worried or calling him out for please let me know okay tag us at trending gist with octavia okay on instagram same name on Facebook. So you can find us and just drop us a message letting us know that there's something, something going on. And if there's any story you want me to run, something you want me to talk about, you can also drop a message. You can get the email. Is My email is here on YouTube. You can send me an email or you can go on my Instagram, DM me or go on my Facebook. And let's discuss more about 90 Days Fiancé. I know a whole lot of you love this program. And come on, we can sit here and dissect and analyze together. Thank you very much. And do not forget to subscribe on notification so you don't miss any upcoming videos.